back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Last time we left off with uh, robbing the horses back from the boat to help out the American Indians or the natives, whatever you want to call them. Uh, this time we're going to do archaeology for beginners. We promised uh, Charles that we'd go and speak to Eagle Flies' father, Rainfall. I've ridden most of the way up here. Uh, and for some reason my other horse decided to randomly appear and start following me. So, I thought it's probably not a good idea to just leave it wandering around on its own. So, I brought it with me. Oh, actually there's a hitching post there. Give me a horse. There's a good guy. Okay, well, it won't let me hit you. Whatever. Wait here. You wait here as well, you plank. Right, let's get on with this. Mister, whatever you're looking for, this isn't the place. Um, I'm pretty sure I want to talk to your leader, so it is a good place to start. I think he's up there. No, he is right here. Hello? Come in. <coughs> you don't sound very well. I'm not. I'm, I think I'm dying. And I hope you find peace. I don't know too much about peace. Apparently not. Did you have fun with my son, the impetuous prince? I believe you went on a raid with him. Um, I'm sorry. I suppose I lack the grandeur of a conventional king. I don't know too many kings. <laughs> Colonel Favors. He has already exacted some measure of revenge for the raid. Two women were assaulted by his men. Um, I'm very sorry about all of this. Yes. Sometimes the correct path, the bravest path, is the least obvious and also the gentlest. I'm, I'm a great disappointment to my son. Your son seems to want a war. My son thinks there is glory in death. Maybe he's right, but for me, I saw death being handed out so freely by the most foolish of men, I never could equate it with victory. Glory has come in service. Maybe. Maybe not, I don't know. I've killed a lot of people. For a whole lot of dumb reasons, and I ain't never seen much glory in it. Well, your friend, Mr. Vanderlyn, he talks a lot. I don't know him, but my son is easily lit. I'm not sure I get you. Uh, well, perhaps we could go for a ride. I'm an old man. My whole life I have tried to bring peace. But uh, I ain't doing so good. Then maybe you can take pity on my plight, please. It won't take long. <coughs> and maybe I can help you with that cough. Sir! Hmm. I'm glad I caught you, sir. Captain Monroe, do you know my friend, Mr. Morgan? No, sir. I don't have the pleasure. Arthur Morgan. It's an honor, sir. How can I help you, Captain? I was just in San Denis. I spoke with the mayor. It's not good news, I'm afraid. May I ride with you for a little? Of course. Follow me. So where okay. are we going? I want to show you a site up in the mountains that's long been sacred to me. Hang on, mate. Get rid of that marker. A place for reflection and healing. Easy. We're gonna get rid of our tuberculosis. I found out where we got our tuberculosis, what by the way. News, I uh, I watched back through my own videos and. We caught it from the guy that we were doing money lending and other sins. If you remember, there was a guy in a like little farm patch, 
uh, that was coughing blo up blood. Uh, well, he coughed blood on us, and that's how we caught tuberculosis, I believe. I could be wrong. Yes, sir. As I mentioned, I did speak again with the mayor and the Bureau of Indian Affairs in Saint Denis at length. But regrettably, it appears the oil company has already received approval to move forward with drilling on the reservation's land. I suppose there's much. So what does that mean for us now? I'm not sure just yet. I didn't get the impression anything would be happening for a few months. I'm very sorry, sir. I did everything I could. I know, Captain. And I assure you I will continue to do as much as I can. Mr. Morgan, would you have time to help me at all? I would rather certain actions were taken by friends outside the tribe. Sure. sure I can help. Wow, well. Honor's gone up Thank quite you. a lot. Come meet me on the reservation whenever you can. Any assistance will be much appreciated, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, I can give a hand. I also need to brush in a bit. Anyway, gentlemen, I won't take up any more of your time. I'll see you both soon. Sure. Thank you, Captain. Enjoy the ride. I should probably catch up with him. We'll continue on this way. I can't. Well, oh, no, I can. For some herbs to give you. Right, hang on. I want me out. Man, I love American Indians. They're so cool. The way they're one with nature and everything. See the wolves over there feasting on that horse? Brutality no. and beauty are both all around us. Yet Where? so often we're unable to see past our own grievances. This is what I try to teach my son. Where? I completely missed it, mate. Oh, I see. Good. There was no need to harm them. It wasn't gonna anyway. Absolutely hate harm wolves. Uh, hate harming wolves. Which is why I took. Mr. Morgan, but don't feel like you have to. It's why I couldn't watch while I had to do it in chapter to two. So. We don't know each other too well, but I wanted to speak to you about your son. I was there on the raid to steal back those horses, and, uh, well, you know something of Dutch, I think. Yes, a little. Mostly from your friend Charles. I don't know. Sorry, uh, hold up a moment. That'll have to wait. Some of the plants I need will be growing down here. Okay. That's a tanning rack. Oh, you're getting that red flower. Or the purple one. No, he's not getting either. Uh, this yellow. Is what I was looking for English mace. Okay, let's continue on. So, okay. what were you talking about before? I don't know why Dutch is getting involved in your situation, and this ain't easy to say, but. I just don't trust that he's got your son's best interests at heart. So what can we do? Kill Dutch. I don't know. <laughs> Charles and I just thought you should be aware. Maybe there's a way to stop things from getting any more out of control. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. You're welcome. Let me give this some thought. The reservation. Things that bad on a reservation? Yes. This conflict with Colonel Favors and his regiment at Fort Wallace continues to worsen. Many of the elders are sick, and the young feel that any compromise is an admittance of defeat. Well, we ain't done much to calm the situation. But I have to continue to seek to resolve matters through peaceful negotiation. War would be futile. 
Your people are lucky to have you. I'm not so sure about that. Well, I think they're lucky to have you. Peaceful American Wait, Indians are the best here. ones to be friends with. I want to pick some ginseng. We don't want to piss off one of the uh, warlike tribes. I'm going to go with him just to make sure he's okay. So English mace, ginseng. What else do we need? Probably one more ingredient. Wait there. I'll put these in your saddlebag. Okay. Mix these together. It tastes awful. But it'll help to keep your strength up. No, oh, it's not gonna cure me. Alright, let's go. It's not much further now. Ginseng and yeah. English mace. I appreciate the herbs, but I think it's gonna take more than that. I saw a doctor and he says I'm in a pretty bad way. I'm sorry to hear that. This situation we're in, me, Dutch, and the others, I don't know how long I got, but some of them, they still got a chance to have a life. I just think it, if I could give them that, then maybe this ain't all for nothing. I think there is much you can still do, Mr. Morgan. Ooh. Let's try not to fall off the mountain. What the fuck did he just shout? That is a beautiful view. Where are we going, Mr. Rainfalls? This can't have been the whole mission, just wandering around a mountain. Maybe it is. It's just up ahead. Oh, okay, we're not too far away then. What's happened? No. Oh god. It can't be. Need to find the Chinupa. Who, who would do this? Someone who wanted to enrage you. Help me look around, please. The Chinupa is gone. Of course. What is it? A uh, ceremonial pipe. Some clues to what happened here. Got a flask. Whiskey. <laughs> Bastards are having a party up here. Oh, fuck it. I'll take it. Why not? There's a uh clue some more whiskey there's some whiskey here okay let me give this some more thought thank you Pour Mr. Morgan I'll take it oh he's found something an empty bottle of whiskey well, if they drank all that, they couldn't have gotten too far. 
There was a camp down there. Yeah, well, still no sign of the Chinupa. Right, I'll get back to searching. There's a clue. Another whiskey flask. Sure looks like they were doing some drinking. Look there. Smoke. Yeah, I saw it a minute ago. Do you have any binoculars? <laughs> oh, there they are. These brave men. Some of Colonel Favor's men. They must have been the ones who did this. Three of them I can see. This happened? Not at all. But but I hope we were past this. Well, you got land they want. Land with oil. They moved us here. They've taken everything we had. I signed three treaties myself, and they've broken each one. No, they've taken the last hope. Don't worry, dude. No, my people are going to want a war. I got this. You wait here. Uh, don't have my bow action, but I got my carbine. Although I probably should have brought my bow. How many throwing knives have we got? Five. That could probably come in handy. Maybe I'll just go in all guns blazing and shoot their faces off. Let's find out when we get there, I guess. Yep, I gotta kill them all. Quietly is probably the best place to go. Should have brought my bow. Fucker. Will you stand still for a second so I can stab you? You're next, mate. Yeah, that's what you get for pissing off my uh, native friends. Don't fuck with my American Indians. And thanks for the gun oil, I can finally clean some of my weapons. They've got some TNT down here. I should have just shot that, I would have killed everyone here.
Wait, is that part of the gun? What have we got here? All right, you need to move out of the way, mate. Come on, move your fat ass. Go sleep over there. Forever. Ooh. I'll take that. Oh, hang on, there was some curves there, it said. Oh, sleep. I'll be taking that. Uh, not entirely sure where I'm supposed to be looking. Can't take that. Maybe one of these dickheads haven't had it on them. Anything on the back of this we can rob? Nope. What about you? Did you have it? No, it didn't. It's got to be around here somewhere. Oh, there's a bloody chest there. I completely missed it. Oh, I'm fucking stuck. Oh, there we go. Kick you in the head, you dick. I'll be taking that jewellery. Poison arrow pamphlet. Nice. We know how to make poison arrows now, I guess. Um, read. Uh, the Trouton must be able to surmount all difficulties, whether saddling with a horse, uh, trenailing a raft, or dispatching wildlife or savages that pose a threat. In some cases, a f the fire. For the firing of an arrow into a man or large beast will enrage them further and result in, in harm to the person. Oh, to your person. The ancient Greeks and Romans understood this and not. Often coated their projectiles with poison. Arrow, feather, or lander plant. Rub a lander plant carefully along the head of the arrow. Store in quiver. Carefully track usage. You should ne never eat game felled by a poisoned arrow. Okay. Wait, what? Oh no. Please don't be broken. That is broken. How that all fit into your pouch, I have no idea, mate. Oh, there's a fucking wizard. <coughs> Come on, we gotta do some climbing. Yeah, I guess uh, matey boy's not gonna to be too pleased. I hope he doesn't mind that I just murdered a few people. A few of them quietly, the uh, rest of them rather loud and proud, but... Oh, what the fuck? Oh, my stamina ran out. Right, let's eat something. Right, no, that's it. Apparently I can't craft anything here. We'll do it after the mission then. Craft that potion thing that he told us about. No, it still can't use it. Yep. Here. What? I, uh, I got your things, I think. Yes. Thank you. I'm very sorry about this. Even 
Sacred things are only things. People, the heart, matter more. Was anyone hurt? Yes. It's a bad business. I should not have let you do this for me. But perhaps it will stop a bigger massacre. With these, maybe I can calm my people. Maybe I can calm my son. Hopefully. So. Thank you. You're welcome. Take those herbs I gave you, please. And most of all, I hope you can find peace within yourself. Cheers, mate. Look at that beautiful gun on his shoulder. Mission complete? I bet you it's going to be like, get five headshots. He's a man who, not so long ago, I would have found weak and pathetic. Now I see as wise and thoughtful and sensible. I would love to help him. Or at least stop Dutch pushing his son to do something real stupid. Right. Ah, oh, we failed something. Recover the relic without being detected. Recover the relics within one minute thirty. How the fuck are you supposed to do that? There's fucking four people set by a campfire. Well three anyway. Right. Um. Spread up route. Uh, show craftable. Apparently, I can't make uh, what I needed. Sage and burdock root, Indian tobacco, ginseng, sage, ginseng and yarrow. Ah, oh, requires a campfire to craft. Gotcha. Oh, can we just set one up here or not? See if we can get this done now. Um, sage and burdock root. No. None of these are the one he told me to make. Some recipes here that we don't actually know. Potent miracle tonic. I suppose we could make one of those. Fuck it, use it. It'll give us some strength back. Right, next time we will be doing uh, the delights of Van Horn. Steal the wagon of explosives from the army convoy on en route, en route to Saint Denis from Ansberg. We've got a mission up here. What's that? Do not seek absolution. Oh, not what I meant to do. Right, so next time we'll be doing Mission with Micah, whichever it was called. The Delights of Van Horn. So thank you all for watching. Like, comment, subscribe if you like it. Not if you don't, as per usual. And I will see you all in the next episode. Adios.